Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to set full screen mode or full screen immersive mode in your app. So here I have created this sample app in which in the main activity I have this options menu which contains this menu item toggle immersive mode. When I click on this it becomes full screen. The top bar and the bottom bar disappear and when I click on it once again it becomes not full screen means it becomes normal so and this is the sticky type immersive mode in which when it is in full screen mode so now it is not in full screen mode and when i drag down from top it shows this notifications but when it is in immersive mode which when it is in full screen mode when i drag down from top it will first display the navigation bars and when I drag down again, then it will display the notifications. And in sticky immersive mode, when we drag down from top or when we drag up from bottom, the bottom and top bars will appear for few seconds only and then they will disappear. In non sticky immersive mode, they will remain, they will not disappear. So let's begin. This is the activity main.xml which contains a linear layout and a text view. In main activity.java, I have this set content view r.layout.activity main in on create. Now, after this, I have this on create options menu. This is outside on create, the on create ends here. And after this, I have this on create options menu. And in this, I have created an options menu. For creating this options menu, I have created a menu folder in the resource folder. And inside this, I have created this file main.xml. You can name it anything else also. So here I have this menu tag. And inside this, I have an item with ID sample underscore action and the title toggle immersive mode. This is the item the menu item for options menu now we go back to main.xml so here i use get menu inflator dot inflate r dot menu dot main comma the menu which is this one and then i return true so this is how i create the options menu here then i have created an java class file which is immersive mode fragment and this immersive mode fragment is a fragment here you can see public class immersive mode fragment extends fragment so this means it is a fragment in the on create event i have only one line of code which is set has options menu true so when we add this we can use the options menu which is created in main activity in this fragment so here the another method is on view created which is empty in on view created i do not have anything next is on options item selected so here you can see that on create options menu is in main activity and on options item selected is in immersive mode fragment so here from this menu item i get the item id and if this item id is equal to r.id.sample underscore action then i toggle full screen and in the end return true okay so it will return true and what is this toggle full screen so when we here when we click on this item that will be executed here if r dot id dot sample underscore action is the item id so then it will execute toggle full screen and that is defined here in toggle full screen, I have defined new UI options equal to get activity dot get window dot get decor view. It will get the decor view and then get the system UI visibility. Okay, and then it has set these flags view dot system UI flag hide navigation flag full screen and system UI flag immersive sticky. And then whatever is the result of this, which is the new options that i have set as the system ui visibility so here you can see this new symbol 
and this is the XOR symbol. XOR symbol followed by equal to. So just I, I will just tell you what is this. So here we can have two kind of modes. Either it can be full screen or not full screen. So here we will consider full screen as one and not full screen as zero. So suppose initially it is not full screen. Initially it is not full screen. Then so uh, here you can see initially it is not full screen. So you can consider it new UI options is zero. And this view dot system UI flag hide navigation is one because it is setting it to full screen and this flag full screen is also one because it will set it to full screen and the immersive stick is also one so all these three are one and initially the new ui options is zero so when we use this operator we'll see the result so i'll show you what is this operator this is a bitwise xor operator and when we use it with equal to sign it is bitwise exclusive or an assignment operator and we will see that xor gate this is the xor gate truth table so uh, let's go back to the project here suppose initially it is not full screen then new ui options will be zero and this is one and here you can see that if this symbol equals if c then this symbol equal to 2 is same as c equal to c followed by this symbol equal to 2 so let's go to this xor table so suppose initially it is not full screen then it will be 0 and we are setting it to full screen which is 1 the result will be 1 which is full screen and if initially it is in full screen and we are setting it to full screen then the result will be zero which is not full screen so i hope you understood these two lines will be executed here so suppose initially it is full screen which is one and we are setting it to full screen which is also one then the result will be zero which means not full screen and this is that's all in this fragment. Now we have to use this fragment in main activity. So we go back to main activity and in on create, we get the support fragment manager and find fragment by tag, frag tag equal to null. This frag tag is immersive mode fragment. So if this fragment is null, then we create this fragment and add it to fragment transaction. So first we define a fragment transaction called transaction equal to get support fragment manager dot begin transaction. Then we define this fragment, which is this immersive mode fragment as fragment equal to new immersive mode fragment. And in this transaction, we add this fragment transaction dot add fragment with the tag frag tag. And then we commit this transaction. So this will add the immersive mode fragment to the main activity okay and that's all is required it will the result i have already shown you here we can toggle between immersive mode full screen mode and not full screen mode now the i'll show you the non-sticky immersive mode this one is system ui flag immersive sticky if you have to make it non-sticky just remove this underscore sticky from here and build it once again so now i have made it non-sticky and now when i click on toggle immersive mode it becomes full screen but when i drag down from top it again becomes normal only at the top the bottom and bottom also and when I again click on the toggle immersive mode, both the top and bottom bar disappear. Now, suppose I pull up from bottom, the bottom bar will appear. And when I pull down from top, the top bar will appear and it will become a normal mode. So, that's on this video. Thank you very much for watching this.